Hi, I'm Rich Morris, uh, Broodminder, and I want to show you how to update your Broodminder T2s to uh, version 2.77 firmware. Uh, version 2.76 was shipped originally until uh, February 14th of 2019, and it had a limitation of, uh, 70, uh, of 96 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, version 277 removes that limitation, and uh, if you received your units before then, then you'll want to update them. Uh, it's easy, and we'll show you how. Uh, I will uh, do it with these devices here. So you want to go out and download the Apiary app, the Broodminder Apiary app. We used it because the Bluetooth controls in it are a little bit more sophisticated and work with this device. Uh, when you load it up, uh, you'll see your devices come up. Uh, you do not need to have a login or anything for this component uh, for the update part of it to work. Uh, you'll see them, and we can see on this that uh, two of these uh, four devices say version 2.76. Those two need updated. The other two are fine. And all you have to do is push the uh, cloud with the arrow in it, and it will say firmware update, uh, important things. And what you want to make sure is that before you do this update, you grab the data out of the devices. Uh, because it will uh, clear the device and you will also need to press the power button after you do the update. So you'll have to take it out of the hive if it's, if it's in there. So we say yes and it says are you sure and gives that and then it goes out and you see it only chose the two that need to be updated to be updating and it's connecting and it'll go through its gyrations and update the firmware. Uh, currently this only works for iOS. Uh, we're still working on the Android version, but Android is uh, more difficult, a lot of different versions out there, so it's taking us longer on that. Uh, we also have a PC version. If you're interested, you can contact us. And you know, if this is too much for you, then we certainly will uh, take care of you. Uh, contact Mike at support at broodminder.com and uh, you can return the devices to us, we'll update them and then ship them back to you. Um, so you can see here it's doing its update, uh, it's about 50% done, it'll keep going and then it will move on to the next device and do that one also. Uh, after it's done, like I said, you'll have to uh, hold the power button for five seconds, that'll turn the device back on and then you should be good to go. So we'll just wait for this one to finish, 91%, and uh, we hope that uh, your hives do well this year, and you know, remember, every hive counts. Thanks.